Cameroon, fighting out of Paris, France, Francis the Predator Gano. Set up the leg kick so he doesn't get it caught and taken down again. Pushing forward, Henrique. Ooh, heavy. Heavy shots by Big Gano. shots. Each and every time. Oh, oh yeah, good he's bloodied up too. Oh, nice Enrique up. bloodied up. And you're starting to see Enrique go for the shot because he's tired on the feet. And that's the truth. And Gano with some serious oh, power. Gano knows it. Oh, he's oh, he's done. Done. Hit it. it. It's all over. Wow. Knockout. Francis Gano. Wow. Vicious uppercut. Serious, serious power from Gano. Outstanding combinations from Gano. Look at this right hand. Sneaks through, catches him on the temple, had him hurt and a barrage. Look at this left uppercut, and oh that, that's the end of the fight right there. He, he landed one more shot afterwards, but he was completely out. He landed that one on the neck, actually. Winner in the second round by knockout in his UFC debut. Well, his family and friends still live in his native Cameroon. There's actually a big MMA scene there, and a lot of its growth is sort of contingent upon the success of this young man, Francis Ngannou. As much as he can do this, that benefits him. I mean, he spent his entire life wrestling. Right. Still goes back to wrestle with his old college team. Oh, Kimura attempt here from Ngannou. God, man, this guy is super strong. Look at this. He has There's he got it. Wow! Francis Ngannou! by submission round one. He's got a lot of outstanding arm attacks. Brian Stan stunned to my right. Four Francis Ngannou, man. Four years ago, this dude didn't even know what MMA was. I mean, that is incredible. Another eye-opening victory. I mean, it takes a tremendous amount of strength to rip that grip apart like that and throw a man yeah. to the floor. And then outstanding knowledge of the submission to get the finish as he pulls it behind the shoulder blade. A lot of people leave it out there wide and try and finish. Nope, and Ganu knew exactly where he needed it to be. Wide, perfect base. This guy is picking up skills and techniques with lightning speed. The question is, how is he gonna do against world-class opposition? And we're talking about the top of the food chain, number one contender, Former K1 Grand Prix champion, former Strike Force heavyweight champion, Alistair Overeem. Not a lot of people burning up Nick Maynard's phone to try to get a matchup with Ngannou. Oh! Goes the win! Francis Ngannou has arrived! Paging Stipe Miocic, Francis Ngannou is coming. Boom! I mean, just perfect on the chin and shut him completely off. Looked like he said, where is the belt? It's in Cleveland, Ohio. I'm on my way to the title shot, so I got to step it because uh, then I would say after the, the winner will win the title shot, so I, I think I got it. Oh, no, you got a title shot. There's no doubt about it, sir. He's one of the craziest stories in all of sports. We're looking at a man that was homeless five years ago just began his martial arts training. Five years later, he's the most exciting challenger ever. He's gotta stay on those singles. And got him pushing down on the head, looking for big bombs. Goodness, he's coming hard. He knows the shot's coming. If you pressure, you force the shot. Oh, good right hand by Stipe. Beautiful. Stipe needs a quick ducking. Oh, nice one, too. Beautiful. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt. Goodness gracious. Stipe shoots again. Oh! Wow. Up, Good shot by Miocic. And he gets Ngannou down again. Oh, oh that's shoot it. right for Ngannou. He heard him. That's it. That's all it takes is one of those. Miocic wisely Beautiful shoots and lands. What an amazing performance, though, by Stipe to overcome the storm of the first round and to fight the kind of fight you have to fight to beat a guy like Francis Ngannou. This rematch between Curtis Razorblades and Francis the Predator Ngannou. But he told me that Curtis Blazes says, all I need to do oh! is get my opponents to Over the top with the right hand! Does Blaze recovery still won't be on his feet? Mark Goddard's taking a closer look. Ngannou's powering in. Oh, this there is bad is. news. That's what? it. Francis Ngannou wow. wins in Beijing, double quick. What a power shot over the top from Francis Ngannou. He's back.
been a hard time, but listen, man, I'm back. This is exactly what I'm saying. I'm back. Junior Sagano Dos Santos has been the man at the top of the heat. Francis Ngannou hoping to eventually hit that rarefied air. This is so nerve wracking. swings and gets clipped with that right hand and then oh, right on the chin over the top and doesn't see it coming and then Engano just laying down some hammer fists and now big shots from the top and Sagano just covers up he does it again sensational first round knockout so here he is folks the number two ranked heavyweight in the world the predator Francis Engano now resides in Las Vegas and Joe Rogan this winning streak has really put him in a place where many believe we are looking at the future Side leg kick is there for Biggie Boy. Oh! Oh! It's all Rosen Strike is out! Whoa. And Ganu! Out bad! Out cold. Holy right. smoke! So Francis and Ganu with his fourth consecutive vicious first Holy round knockout. Cow. You can't make any mistakes. You can't be there when the punches slam. He's too powerful. The question is, is he ready? Because I believe. He is a much better fighter than he was then, but I also believe Stipe Miocic is not just a phenomenal champion, but a better version of that phenomenal right. champion than he faced in 2018. You this can is tell. Oh! Oh! Stipe took that though. Wow! Big improvement. Big actually did the right thing on the defense. He was able to. Oh, my look at this. Big ground strikes here. Oh, Stipe one of those real clean. trouble. Real oh, trouble. Huge win. Right. Miocic. Francis has got to be careful to not load up and leave these big openings. Oh, Stop! Knocked out for Stop. 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 That's as nasty as it oh ever gets. Oh my goodness. In UFC appearance, number 13, Francis Ngannou finally oh, breaks a... through and becomes the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world.